welcome back to our channel today we have a very special vlog for you because it is the end of the summer holidays and the start of some very big new adventures mm -hmm. ah. so logan what year are you going into at school Year one. I'm going into year four. And then the big one this year is... I am going to secondary school. Woohoo! Yeah. This is not a surprise for you guys. Anyone who's been following us for a long time now, you'll know that this has been building to this very week. Yep. Um, so you actually have one more day off. Yeah. These two go back to school tomorrow. So yeah, you two, how are you feeling about going back to school? Year one and year four. Mm -hmm. You can answer, yeah. You put <laughs> You're your hand already up. ready for school. He's put ready your for school. Up. He's put his hand up. What, Go on, tell what us. are you going to say, mate? Uh, uh, I really like school because PE is my favourite school year. It's your favourite subject. Ah, oh, that's good. Cool. You love it. We are getting you ready for bed. Early night. Guys, look at me. Oh. <laughs> sad for an early, morning, early night and early morning. Yeah. The alarms are set for. Up at six tomorrow to wake up. No, I still have to wake up. I'm feeling really excited to see my friends and my teacher, but I'm also feeling um, a little bit nervous. Nerves Everyone, are normal, aren't they? Yeah, I think. Everyone feels nervous on their first day. I don't know anyone who doesn't like bubbles in their bath. Me. What? I hate bubbles. I know, you're so crazy. You can do bath time. I'm going to go and get their uniforms ready. Oh, have fun. Get your uniform out. Hi. Polo shirt. School shoes are already out, book bags are already out, lunch boxes are in the kitchen ready to go, water bottles are out. School uniform for Logan is now out and ready. Thankfully it's such a hot day there is no need for like shirt tie and all that stuff. It's summer uniform so it's just polo shirt and shorts. Right, Libby. Yeah. Should we get your uniform out ready? So Libby Lulu's. Yep. You have a polo shirt, yep. a grey skirt, shorts yep. to go under your skirt because you like to do flips and rolls on the bar. Yeah. Okay, what socks are you wearing for school tomorrow? Uh, I was planning to wear like three ones. Good night. Good night. See you in the morning. Yeah. See you when you're in year one. See you <laughs> As Holly gets to stay up later than the other two, that can seem a little unfair for Olivia. So we've been using the BB and Tina audio plays. We found them to be really relaxing and has helped us to get a good evening routine back after our summer holidays. What are you listening to? I'm listening to BB and Tina. What's it about? It's about Tina's friend moving schools. Poor Alex. It's hard not to feel sorry for him right now. He looks like a zombie as he walks down the castle hallway. But suddenly, he starts yelling and screaming, letting out all his frustration and anger. Unfortunately, I can't tell you what he was yelling, but let's just say it's a good thing the castle was well soundproofed. I can relax knowing this series is perfect for Olivia and features topics that are relevant and age appropriate. I like Bibi's character because she's a witch and she's really funny. Head down to the description box below if you want to find out more about the BB and Tina audio plays. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Good morning. How are we all feeling? How are you feeling, Livy? First day of school. Good. Good. Looking forward to it? Excited? Good. What about you, Logan? First day in year one. Yay. Are you excited? Really excited. Oh, that's wicked. I'm not even feeling nervous a tiny bit. Oh, wicked. That's really good. What are we up to today then? You have a day off today, last full day off, and I said you could do anything you wanted. And I want to go shopping with my friends. So we're going to go and pick up two of your friends, and we're going shopping. Anything in mind that you want to buy? Clothes. Oh. <laughs> okay. Joint effort making packed lunch. Let's do this. Libby, what fruit do you want? Strawberries and a cheese sandwich like normal. Strawberries, a cheese sandwich, a yogurt, treat. She really Go and have a look in the treat drawer and see what you want to pack in your lunch And box. you know you can't have chocolate. They're going shopping today, but they're going to have to take my car because my car's you, Liz, but I forgot I've put the anniversary present in the boot, so they're going to, and we're all sick. Like <laughs> So I've got to quickly go and sneak to the car before I get caught. Ooh, what you got? Been shopping? Yeah. Been sat here drinking my coffee, watching TikTok. What you got? You know the thing I was going to get in Superdrug? Yeah. For like £10. Mm -hmm. £4.50. Yay, super dud. Jupe. And then I got... Smints, of course. 
And then I've got the long sleeve one for... Yes, you've been looking for that. Yeah. Two pounds, what a bargain. What are they like, dip and rolls? They're like pancakes and ice cream, I think. Mm. You want to pick one? Have a little mid-shopping treat? Cookie dye. Oh my gosh, so you've got like a one to share for whilst they were making it. These would be what I would pick, the lotus one, that's what I would pick. So good. <laughs> How do you think Logan's getting on at school? What about Livy? Yeah, I know, we should definitely feel bad for them. How are you girls feeling about starting year seven tomorrow? Good. Good? No, you're feeling fine? This is such a nice treat to have on the last day off. How was year four? Good. What did you, how did you try and trick me when you came out? I said Terry. How was your day? Good. You had a nice day? Good. And your teacher is nice? Good. And you're sitting in a nice space on the carpet? Good. And your burger was good? No. <laughs> no. no! You are so desperate for a packed lunch, aren't you? Yeah. But Mummy said... I do not like the burgers. Okay, well tomorrow's not a burger. On the burger day, we have to have a packed lunch. What else did you have to eat then? Chips and burgers. So what else did you eat um, if you didn't eat your burger? Did you just eat chips? Um, did you have any corn and cucumber and stuff? I ate some, some of my burger. I ate uh, all of my, not peas. Uh, Sweet corn? Yeah. Good boy. What was for pudding? Yogurt. What? Pink yogurt. It's when it's cheese and crackers. It's not even a pudding. Cheese and crackers is not a pudding. Yeah. So we've got to get all our stuff ready for Holly tomorrow. Yeah. We've just bought some pizza. insoles for her shoes pizza. because her shoes were a pizza. bit slippy. Pizza. Holly's friend's going home at dinner time, so we will just chill until then. And yeah, then it's all go, 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 getting Holly ready for her first day. Just sat on um, Olivia's bed. So Ryan's cooking dinner for everyone. But what I thought I'd share on here is just some of the tips that we've done with back to school nerves. We always try and make sure we meet up with Holly's friends the day before she goes back to school. So like you saw today, we spent the day with two of her friends so that she can feel like you've got your friendships yeah. there. It's a tight friendship. You've got someone who... Because I used to have quite... I used to have friendship um, group issues. So like knowing that they're all gonna be fine knowing that I still have a good relationship with all my friends it just helps me calms and nerves calm down the other thing that we've always done which um as you can see we haven't done it this time is just making sure her things are ready the morning of the day before so rather than leaving it to before bed because then what would happen is as she's getting all her things out for um, back to school just before bedtime the anxiety would really rise and then it would stop her from being able to fall asleep and then she would get upset because she was tired and then she wouldn't sleep very well which would make the morning really hard so we've always made sure we get everything out earlier than the night before and we have kind of done that haven't we so on Monday we got everything out we labeled it all up we checked the shoes we checked which socks she's gonna wear with the shoes like you look it I looks like there's nothing there literally so if you guys struggle with back to school or you have a child that struggles with um, the back to school nerves then hopefully some of those tips will help you as well the last thing that we did oh airplane and this now depends on whether or not they have a good first day or you can do it on the next day if they have a really good second or third day or in the second week but whenever it is when they get home from having a really great day is make a little video to the future selves so we have a little sweet little video of holly where she says hello future me and she tells herself that everything was fine at school there was no need for the nerves and she'd had a really rough night the night before and then a great first day at school so we filmed this video oh bless you and now whenever well not anymore but then after that every time she had nerves going back to school i would show her the video and it's a funny video so it would make her laugh and then she would realize with her own words that yeah. going back to school was never as bad as she pictured i used to have to do it with fish fingers because i used to always say that i didn't like fish fingers <laughs> so we made a video oh, when i, I said that, that i liked them we said i said to me i forgot that. hello me Fish fingers are yummy. And we had, me and Daddy had a whole WhatsApp group just for Holly's food likes with videos that we had. 
which said that what ones you liked so that we could always have your videos. I'd totally forgotten about that. Yeah. You're a fussy eater, Missy. I'm a very fussy eater. You okay? Yeah, I'm good. Proud of you. Thanks. You're so well. Yeah, I am. <laughs> so show me, what have you packed? Right, so I packed a mini so spray in case I am smelly off the pew. I also packed lip balm, some mints. Uh huh. Fresh and breath, y'all. I think I packed an extra hairband. So you've also got your lunchbox, which everyone is telling us that you won't bother having after a few days. Yeah, and then... And then your pencil case. Yeah. Okay, so Holly's just gone to go and have a shower and wash her hair. So in secondary school, she doesn't have to have her hair tied up. This is all new to me, um, and so she would like me to blow dry her hair for her tonight. So that's what we're doing. The little two are now in bed. Ryan's doing the dishwasher. I've just put a load of washing on, um, ready to go on through the night, and I can hang it out in the morning. Going out. Uh, oh yeah, you're going out. Where are you going? I'm going to play badminton. <laughs> Do not put that in. Please don't I'm put that in. That in. <laughs> Lisa. <laughs> the stone in. Twenty <laughs> past seven. You've yeah. got forty minutes. Four zero. Okay. Okay. What is your order of getting things done? Teeth. Uniform. Uniform. Uh, Did have a little wobble yeah. last night. She um. Yeah, all came flooding out. She was very emotional, got very upset. Um, just gonna make sure I'm completely free to be with her this morning. Um, and Ryan, remember you're gonna be dressed and ready so that you can walk with her if she decides at the last minute she needs someone to walk with her. Yep. Obviously you walk on your own, she's walking on her own. Um, but it's a little walk to where her friend is. So Ryan's just gonna be dressed and ready in case. The nerves are too much. She's ready. I've embarrassed you in front of our neighbours making you take photos on the doorstep. Yeah. And I even made you uh, pose in your blazer. It, because it's such hot weather, we got an email from the school to say that you don't need to take your blazer, which is really rare, apparently. Yeah, it is. Now give us a 12, show us your backpack on. <laughs> All the ice in your water bottle. I'm, I'm such not, an overprotective I'm, mother. I'm, one second. Please don't ever call it a backpack, because this backpack sounds like a... Let's go, it's got a backpack. <laughs> Can you say that? School bag. <laughs> I'm sorry. She has school bag. <laughs> nah, she's like, I'm out now. <laughs> How are you feeling? Are you okay? Are you nervous? Are you doing all right? I'm good. I'm doing fine. It feels really weird to not have your hair tied up though. Yeah, I like it. It looks lovely. You, you got this. I can't go out there because I'm in my PJs. Holly, go smash it, baby girl. First day of secondary school. Done. Yes. All done. How's about you start by telling us about last night? Um, I was quite nervous. I felt like I didn't have everything out and I just didn't feel like I had enough stuff to go and I didn't feel ready. As I was blow drying your hair, I was asking you loads of questions, wasn't I? Like, what time are you meeting your friend? Have you got your summer homework in your bag? And I was asking you so many questions and all of a sudden you're like, I'm not ready. Yeah. Um, mm. So we just went through every problem, didn't we? Every question, every worry, and one by one, we just found the solution and made sure. And one of your biggest things was, what if the school uniform feels funny? I don't like mm -hmm. the feel of it. And I was like, yeah. that, you can't solve that one, you have to just suck it up. Mm -hmm. That's the strange thing about secondary school, isn't it? Yeah. But what we're dying to know is how was it today? It was, it was fine. It wasn't like, it wasn't fun. So, normally the first day in primary school, you get to like do fun things. It's not like that in secondary school. Straight to work. Was it as bad as you thought? No. Mm -hmm. Daddy bought you some flowers. Yeah. Let me show everyone. Why did he buy you these? Uh, because he's so proud of me. And he was following your Apple AirTag. And because you wasn't where you were said you were going to be at the time he thought you'd be, he literally started walking down towards the school. That yeah. nourished you. He just rocked up outside the school. He wasn't outside the school, we were walking down 
and me and my friends were taking that picture and Esme was just like, Holly, your dad's here. I was like, oh, why are you here? <laughs> he was so panicky about you. I've managed to talk dad into doing a barbecue. I was like, oh, it's so hot. Why don't we have a nice barbecue? It means I don't have to cook. Dad can do all the cooking. Yeah. Right, should we sort your flowers out? Oh, look at Holly's cards from her nanny and granddad. And this one came from her godmother today. So lovely. I know that Karis and Scarlett watch our video, so thank you so much for Holly's lovely things. So lovely. I said she's shown me up because I didn't get you a good luck card for your first day. Oh, but careful. you could say it in person. Yeah, that's true. How have you coped at school today with this heat? Yeah. You're our okay? teacher, our teacher was last out to collect us at lunchtime break, and lunchtime break was the sunniest. Was it? And we had to stand at our pencil. Oh, did you manage to find some shade though for the rest of it? Mm -mm. I just kept saying to Daddy today, I feel so sad for the kids to go to school in this heat. I tried to get some housework done, it was just too blooming hot. So I only managed to hoover the front room and clean both the bathrooms mm -hmm. and tidy your bedroom. That's all I managed. Jessie, did you smell the sausages? Is that what's going on here? Excuse me. We've not tried Holly's on the barbecue before. Holly's Linda oh, McCartney nice. sausages. Gosh, you got a bag in there, Liz. Oh. What do we say to Dad? Where? Thank you. Where? <laughs> so are you moving? <laughs> Night one. They've set you homework. Oh, I think that's mean. I know, it's horrible. What have you got to do? Draw Queen Victoria? No, you have to draw a historical person and write some facts about them. Why did you choose Queen Victoria? Because it was the first person that came to me. Oh, okay. Imagine it. And people coming up with like some fancy names that I don't even know who are. Oh. And I was like, what the hell? What the hell? You're seriously just going to trace it through your phone? Yeah. I think that's kind of genius. Do you think your teacher will know that you've cheated? No, she'll just know I'm good at art. Oh, okay. I am good at art. You are good at art. Oh, it's a hot one today, guys. It's Thursday. So Holly seemed a lot less nervous today and it was PE day so she was really happy that she got to wear a PE kit because it's just shorts and t-shirts so she felt nice and cool. I've got my godson for the day today. It is a teacup. He's only two and I've just sent Ryan out to go and clean the water table because we haven't used it all summer and it was all gross and that's all he wanted to play with. So uh, Ryan is busy. <laughs> Cleaning. <laughs> Cleaning the water table for Jack to play with. Chuck everything in there. Jackie gonna make me a cup of tea. The kids absolutely love it when we have Jack over. They all idolise him, so they're gonna be really excited when they get him from school and see that we have him for the afternoon. It's very cute having a two-year-old back in the house and does make me and Ryan question whether or not we should have just had one more baby. Because if we had have had another baby, he or she would probably be around two, so. <laughs> it's very sweet looking after him. We really love it. Ryan is out at golf. What are you doing? Going to play? I'm going to play golf with Joel and Pete and, and Joe. So he's going to play, Ava's dad. what is it, golf? The driving range with Ava's dad, Joel, my dad. Oh look, my, I'm, she's so hot. My head, hair is sweating, sticking to my neck. So gross. How was school? Good. You okay? Was she the only person wearing your football socks or were no, everyone? No, I wasn't. It's quite a nice PE kit to be fair, isn't it? Oh, hello girls. Hello. You had a good day at school? Yes. Yeah. Yeah? What are you up to? Why are you all in here when the air conditioning is on down in the den? It's so hot in here. We're getting a drink. Yeah. So everyone's home from school. Got six kids. Look at my husband. Excuse me. Mm -hmm. We're looking after six children. Uh, okay. Is this a good time to uh, take a nap in the sun? Such a good time. <laughs> Friday morning. And uh, happy anniversary. Yeah, happy anniversary, babe. <laughs> 16 years married. Yep, 20 years together. Yes. Oh, 20, so we've come years. to, where is this Virginia Water? Yeah, Virginia Water. Savile Waters. Lake? Savile Garden? Savile. 
Yeah, no. Savile Gardens. So we're walking towards Savile Gardens. Yeah, you know, coffee and cake. So you've taken me out for a nice morning walk. I do yeah. have work to do today, but um, you know, special occasion and all that. Yeah, it's anniversary. Um, yeah. The only trouble with going walking with Ryan, he walks so fast. I am like a power walker. I have to like hold you back, yeah, like stop walking so fast. And I actually, when I start walking slowly, once I've started walking slowly, then I start picking up speed. I'm picking up speed. <laughs> you just can't help it. it. I just can't. It's just my natural, yeah. natural walking space. It's about half an hour walk to the coffee shop. Yeah. Half Go and an hour get walk. coffee and cake. Mm -hmm. And then we're out for dinner tonight. So my mum and dad are babysitting. Yeah, which I'm looking forward to. We were so late for the school run this morning. <laughs> yeah. Like we nearly didn't make it to right, the school like, gate. No. The kids are so tired. Yeah, mash up, they're mashed. They can have a very relaxing weekend, I'm, no doubt. Yeah. And chill out hard. Yeah. And it's hot. It's very hot. Hey. It's Friday, yeah. Hey. Strong look. <laughs> Strong look. Go on. Well, actually, Go on. Yes, girl. Yes, girl. Your head. Your head. <laughs> <laughs> it's a tiny little spider. No, it's not. You didn't touch it though. It's okay. How was school today? It was good. Had a good day. My God, it was oh, so it's funny good. because when we were going out of history, Honey, can you there, was, my there was obviously two boys who were racing, and me and my friends were talking. They barged into us and just barged past us. And God, it's so funny. This is a weird look because I have a swimming costume <laughs> and pajamas on because I'm Crocs on. Well, strong look. Uh, because I'm going to a pool party. Awesome. To my friend's house. Very nice. Very, very nice. So, what we want to know is how has your first week back been? It has been really, really, really fun. Because I have the best teacher. Nice. Holly, first ever week at secondary school. <laughs> you said to me, I don't know what to say when people ask how it's been because it's not been amazing, but it's not been bad. So I just say good. And that's yeah. okay. But it's been okay. Thank you so much for spending the week with us and seeing how we got on starting secondary school. It's been mm -hmm. a big step. Yeah. It has. But you smashed it. And we're mm. so proud of you. Yeah. Hope you've all had a great week and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.